Hi, this is Matt from DigitalArtsFront.com. This is the first video in a series I'll be making about Photoshop retouching and enhancing techniques. In this video I'm going to show you how you can fake the effect of a polarizing filter. There's two parts to this. The first uses the channel mixer and the second uses layer masks. So let's start with this image. It already has a lot of good color but we want to make the sky pop just a little bit more. So we'll start by adding a new adjustment layer with the channel mixer. And we'll leave it at the default settings for now so that we can change it to an overlay in the blend mode. Okay, and you can see at the moment it looks pretty bad so we'll open up the controls of that channel mixer and switch it to monochrome and then start playing with the red channel. We'll take it down a bit probably to about there and you can see we're getting some nice color in that sky now but you can see this channel mixer is now affecting the rest of the image which was already okay so what we do to fix that is we use a layer mask which when you use adjustment layers they already have a layer mask attached to them so we'll start by clearing that out select all delete in the layer mask and then we'll get a gradient white to black and starting at the top we'll just create a gradient down almost to the bottom to about there and you can see almost instantly that sky comes out a lot more so obviously have a play around with your channel mixer settings and the placement of your gradient if you find that the effect is too much just dial down the opacity of the the layer a bit you can control a lot of stuff just from doing that and that's pretty much it even if you don't have a polarizing filter for your camera you can still get some very good results with this technique thanks for watching the video and keep an eye out for my future videos